So if y'all saw my previous episode on my other channel of the Christmas lighting back when we lived in Memphis, um, you saw that we kind of go all out on outdoor lighting, so I did kind of miss that this year. So, but hopefully I don't get spoiled to just not having to put up lights. But in today's episode, we did put up a good number of inside decorations. So, in today's video, we are going to be walking all around this entire house and looking... I'm not going to just be walking, like, all around the house on camera. I'll jump cut. But still, we'll be walking around this entire house and checking out every single Christmas decoration. So, let's head on in and get to it. So, like I said, we'll get you some outside lights next year if that's what y'all are wanting to see. But this year... We will still check out the decorations we do have. And along the way, stop in at Love's Cabin. What's Love's Cabin? You'll see when we get up there. All right, let's head on. First stop, the front stairs. Here we have two. And here comes a playful dog. I have to shine a light in her eyes or she'll jump on me and push me on the ground. And there goes the playful dog. Bye-bye. So right here we have two very cute little trees. They're green with red bows on them. So these are very cute. There's another one. Again, big red bow. And here comes the playful dog again. Up on the porch, we have a Christmas star and a Christmas lantern, which is totally supposed to be solar-powered and turned on at night, but it's not. Over here, we got a little Christmas bush. And right here, we have a beautiful Moravian star. And the playful dog again. And remember how I said we were going to stop by Love's Cabin? Here it is. Let's see if anyone's home. No? She's not home. Where's she at? Where's she at? Where's she at? Uh, is her heating pad working? Stop licking me. Is her heating pad working? Oh, yes, it's putting out some nice heat. Okay, let's go ahead and check out the inside stuff. That's the only door in the house that the still can be opened with a uh, builder's key. So I think it'd be kind of cool just to leave it like that. Probably not the most secure thing. But one, hopefully they trash all the builder's keys. And two, we have an alarm. So... You can't come in tonight, honey. No, no. No, no. That's <laughs> sweet. No, no, we love you. No, we love you. You sweet baby girl. We love you. No, no, we love you. No, no. She's just laying there with her. <laughs> she just jumped around and went on back. Bye bye. Tail wagging. Look at that. No, she can't do that. So I don't know. No, 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 no. Sure.
Okay, guys, we've been all around the house. We've seen all the Christmas decorations. Well, I might have missed some because there are, are a lot. But, do you know what I think of at Christmas time? That's right. Like everyone, I think of Jingle Bells. Well, that might have not been the first thing that came to y'all's mind. But, uh... It probably, it's something about Christmas. Christmas has bells. Christmas time, I mean, you just think of that like jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. You just think of bells a lot at Christmas time. So, I was thinking, what if we ring some bells? I'm not talking about the bells in your hand. I'm talking about something different. I'm talking about this bell. That's right. This is the bell I'm talking about. This is my Christmas jingle bell. And I'm thinking, let's give this thing a ring. To activate it, we are going to be using... Not that pulsation. <laughs> it was Christmas... It's a good pull station, but not for Christmas. For Christmas, we need to do something truly classic. The simplex. And I should just acknowledge that beep real quick. So, we're not going to do this for too long. But since it'll stop, I pressed acknowledge. It's, um, tomorrow is Christmas Eve day. And then day after tomorrow's Christmas Eve, I think we should go ahead and give it a ring. So, let's do it. Let's hear the jingle bells in three, two, one. Wow. That sounded beautiful. Now, we need to reset the pull station. And then, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and go for a system reset after this. Which we can't do with the fob. We have to type in a code to completely reset it. Set it. And there we go. There was our fire alarm. Jingle bells. And with that being said, I guess that will be about it for my Christmas special. So, thank you so much for watching this video, my Christmas special. Really hope you enjoyed it. Really hope it was fun for y'all to watch. Really hope it turned out okay. And, uh, yeah. So, thank you so much for watching my Christmas special. Really hope you enjoyed it. And, I guess with that being said, that will be just about it. So, thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you in another video. Bye for now. See ya.